Plus she choosy, bad and bougie That means she get what she like Make these niggas feel the pressure Until she meet Mr. Right I can't blame her, it's her life I can't tame her, she on Channel I don't ask you guys so much Like I feel like I've been gone for so long But it's okay cause I'm back And in the video I just Like I explained why I've been gone so long And The wait is over, I'm back And I'm not going nowhere because it's time to get this this YouTube channel booming, okay? You feel me? So, yeah, right. without further ado, before I keep rambling, let's get right into the video. Hey guys, so jumping right into the video, um, as you can see, I already did one eye and I filled in both of my eyebrows, but I was like, hold on, let me wait and show them what I've been using to conceal my brows with. Cause girl, I do something different now. I ran out of my MAC concealer. So I was like, let me go buy something different. Let me try something else. And I picked up the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. I love this. However, I feel like for my face, for highlighting my face, it's bomb. But for concealing my brows, it's a little too light. Like it makes some joints pop out. So I mix it with this like Ruby Kisses Concealer and it's in the color Beautiful Bronze. And I got this one in tan. So I carved out my brow and now I'm going to blend the concealer into my skin and like combo ish wish popping. This sounds like I'm about to do a legit tutorial and it's not supposed to be a tutorial, it's about to be a it's supposed to be a chit chat life update get ready with me girls day out situation. So let me get to the chit chat. Why have I been gone for so long? Um School has been a bit, not the work, it's just like I feel like I'm involved in a lot this year, like this is the first year that I've had a job on campus and this is also the first year I'm on exec for a modeling team. I've just been having more responsibilities than I usually have and I'm not gonna lie, I was quite shook at first, like first two, three weeks. I was like, how the fuck on? I go straight to class. From class, I go straight to work. And I work either from like 2 to 7, which is a long ass time in my opinion, or I'll go straight to practice. And it's tough. I mean, I like being productive all day and I like like always having shit to do. But girl. So now that I like blended it out with my finger or whatnot, I'm going to get some airspun powder or whatever and I'm going to set that with like a fluffy brush. Put a little bit on there and just set my concealer. I'm taking that same brush. I'm going to dip it in this color right here from the Carly Bible palette. And I'm just going to put that all into like my crease, my upper crease. Like this is basically going to be my transition shade so yeah that's why i've been gone and um i'm on fall break right now which is why i have more time to film and which is why i'm not in my dorm room i'm in my bedroom from home so yeah but it's okay because i'm back now so now i'm working on a schedule so sunday is usually my most chill day so i'm gonna try to um I'm going to try to record in the mornings of each Sunday and hopefully I'll be able to either edit the video that Sunday as well and y'all will get it Monday or by the latest you'll get it Tuesday. But hopefully you'll get it Monday. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully you'll get it Monday. Now I'm going to take a different brush. This is not the same brush I used to blend out my concealer. That was shit. Wait. Which brush is it? Oh God. So I'm just going to get this brown shade right here. Oh, I picked up a lot. And I'm going to put that into my crease. Let me talk about the look I'm going for right now. Like the makeup look I'm going for, whatever. I wanted to do like a monochromatic look. Same color of your eyeshadow should be the same color as your lip combo or whatever. And I wanted to use these two ColourPop colors. I think they're both from the Karuchi line. Yeah, this liner is called Rooch. Oh, they're both Rooch. Okay, yeah. They are dirty. Um, I wanted to use these 
bad boys but and i was gonna do like a cranberry eyeshadow look but i guess i don't have a lot of cranberry eyeshadows like the colors that i put on this eye were supposed to be cranberry and they're most definitely not so um now i'm taking this brush oh my god i haven't been telling you you guys what brushes i've been using so to cover my brows this is a morphe brush to blend out that concealer was an elf blending brush and then to set my concealer and to put this transition shade i use the bh cosmetics number five brush. and now i'm going in with this color from the carly nope I lied. I'm going in with this color from the Carly Bible Palette with my BH Cosmetics V5 brush. <sighs> that was a mouthful. So yeah, I'm just blending this all into that first shade that I put into my crease. And I'm blending it upward. And I'm really trying not to touch my lid at all because I'm going for like a halo look or whatever. So yeah, don't really touch your eyelid. Just being, stay in your crease. Stay in your lane, sis. Stay in your crease. I'm trying. Okay, anyways. So, uh, life update. Um, what's been going on? My little brother EJ is on the way, like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Like, my mom is ready to pop. Um, now I'm taking this color with the same brush into, I'm gonna do my outer my outer V first. So yeah, what else has been going on? Um, I recently just got out of a relationship. So, team single. <laughs> I'm a whole joke. Anyways, now that I put that into my outer V, I'm going to go into like my inner corner and pack the same color, same brush into my inner corner. And guys, I'm so excited. I finally reached 50 subscribers. Like, Okay, okay, back to business because I actually have somewhere to go today. So where am I going today? Um, I'm super duper happy because I'm going to see my sister and my best friend. And we're going on like a little girls day out situation. Like we're going to go to the mall and we're going to go out to eat and then we're going to go visit my brother. You guys, you guys will like see them soon because they're going to do like tags with me and whatnot like i'm gonna do the sister tag and i think i'm gonna do the spicy noodle challenge with my best friend so um now i'm just blending the outer corner and the inner corner into like my upper crease now i'm gonna take like this flat brush from morphe as well and i'm gonna pick up yeah can you see it i'm picking up this color it's like a iridescent eyeshadow i don't know i'm gonna use it with a dry brush at first and then i'm gonna take some setting spray and put it on there as well hold on hold on i skipped the step before i do that i'm gonna carve it out i'm gonna i don't know i guess like where i put my halo at that's where i'm gonna carve it out uh, if that makes any sense okay so boom so this is what we have so far i'm gonna try to get in focus oh. now that i got my concealer on i'm just gonna take a clean finger and i'm going to like blend out the sides of it now I'm gonna go in with that iridescent shade or whatever right here it's gonna like pack that all over the center of my lid and now that I have a base or whatever I'm gonna get my BH cosmetic studio pro setting spray and I'm just gonna spray my brush I'm gonna take the NYX matte liquid liner all right so I did my liner or whatever. Now that my liner's on, it's time to put my lashes on. These are the lashes that I'm using today. Or whatever. This is what it look like. And this is what the actual lash looks like. Girl, it look bomb.com. This is what came inside the lash thing. This is the glue and this is the like tweezer applicator it came with. I didn't use neither one of those, so I really don't know how good they were. But this is the lash glue I used. Um, I think I showed you guys this before. I totally skipped a step too. I usually always put mascara on my lashes first and I most definitely did not do that. Okie dokie, so now that my eyes are together, I got my lashes on and whatnot, I'm about to move on to my face. I probably look ashy right now because I just primed my face with this 
BH Studio Pro Foundation Primer. My edges is fleeky though. Y'all see my, my edges. Ew. Um, I'm also using a Real Techniques Beauty Blender sponge or whatever. Now that that is done, I'm going to get my Tarte Shape Tape and I'm going to highlight. Now I'm going to set that with my Air Sponge. I'm just setting the parts that I just concealed first because I don't bake. And I don't want my concealer to start creasing while I'm blending out my under eye concealer. Now I'm going to put just a little bit under my eyes. So I'm using the Ruby Kisses Contour Color in Ebony, as I always do. I'm going to put a little bit on my forehead. And when I blend my contour, I blend, I push upwards. I don't ever go down because I don't want it to look muddy. Contour my nose and I'm using the same brush that I always use to contour my nose. And I'm taking the NYX Love Contours All palette and I'm taking that color. Literally like one drop of color. And I'm going to contour my nose. And I go up and meet my eyebrow. Now I'm going to set my entire face with this BH cosmetic spray let that sit and y'all already know I'm gonna highlight with my fave Laura Geller now it's time to finish the under eye so I'm gonna take this brush also don't know where I got this from I'm so sorry and I'm gonna mix two different colors I'm taking this like purpley color right here from the love contours all kit taking a little bit of that and I'm gonna mix it with the color that we used earlier and I'm going to put that under my waterline. Then after that, I'm going to smoke it out. And I'm going to put on mascara. And the look should be done. I got some new mascara. It's from Maybelline. It's called the Lash Sensational Curvitude. It's waterproof. It really is waterproof. It takes so long to come off. I swear to God. That's the only thing I don't like about it. So for my lip, I'm just going to use this like dark brown lip liner. So use any dark brown liner. Or black I don't know do they have black lip liners I like the darkest brown you can and I'm taking instigator from Mac or whatever so yeah this is what it looks like snapchat is so dis like distracting like so yeah guys that's the end of this video i hope you enjoyed hope you learned something new about me and i hope you were entertained so don't forget to like comment share and subscribe thanks guys i'll see you next time